Hey guys, on this block by block of Red Power, we are going over the Red Power pump, fluid pipes, and fluid grates. So basically, all three of these things work in conjunction to have a liquid transportation system for moving around water and fun things like that. So basically, the grate is the input and output. Wherever you put this grate is where the water is going to suck into and then be pushed out of, as you can see over here. Now you can see this little gold part on the grate, that is where the fluid pipe will connect to, as you can see. And you can right click to rotate that around with a screwdriver. Okay, next we have the pump itself. Now. The pump itself is very user friendly actually. You can see these arrows on it that actually indicate which way the water goes. So we have these arrows pointing in on this side. That means water goes in here. Then we have arrows pointing outwards on this side, which means water's going out. Then we also have this little arrow right here above this blue power indication. That little blue light will be off if there's not enough power. That little yellow arrow points this way, which means water comes in this way and goes out that way. And yes, this thing does need blue power, so I just have a little battery box and solar array set up here to power it. And it's pretty nifty. So down here, I have an infinite water source set up. Again, the grate is where the water gets pulled in, and then there's another grate over here where the water gets pushed out. And I have an enclosed container, because if you don't have an enclosed container and you leave an infinite water source like this pumping water, it will just kind of go crazy and fill up your whole world with water. So that is just a cautionary tale for you. But basically you just turn this on and you'll see it will start pumping water. And this solid container I've built will just slowly start filling up. So you can use this for water storage tanks for whatever reason. Um, if you have other mods installed that need water, this could be useful. You could use it to create artificial lakes, artificial oceans, maybe move some lava around. So just anything like that is pretty much what you can use this machine for. And uh, it's, like I said, it's pretty neat if you have an infinite water source set up like this because it's just going to keep pumping and just fill things up as much as it can and oh my goodness badness just happened oh right okay so make sure your grate is inside the enclosed container because as you can see that top part of the grate was exposed and so since this thing had filled up it was going to start dumping water into the world but luckily that stopped before catastrophe so that is the pump fluid pipe and great. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time. Toodles!